girlfriend, 20F, gets mad over me, 19 meters, seeing any type of nudity. Exclamation mark. Hello everyone. Me and my girlfriend are always arguing over this subject because we both have different opinions on this. Anyways we've been dating for one year now. Friday. And in the beginning of our relationship she said. No strip clubs and no porn. I agreed and said I understand and will respect that and have respected that. Turns out later into our relationship any TV shows or movies with nudity in it. She expects me to cover my eyes like a child or turn away or she gets mad at me. Which happens every time because I feel weird having to cover my eyes over a pair of women breast. On the screen like I'm 10 years old watching a movie with my parents. We eventually tried to avoid anything that could have nudity in it but of course a lot of movies are. Shows have that in it so it comes up every so often. There's also shows or movies I enjoy Cough Cough the Wolf of Wall Street that she gets insanely mad. If I watch alone and just says things like I'm going to touch myself to it or I'm going to think of them while me and her are having sex just etc like she's trying to guilt me or some but it's becoming too much and progressively getting worse just recently I found out I'm not allowed to go into Victoria's Secret and with Valentine's coming up I was interested in going in there to get something for me and her but I couldn't do that because she was freaking out over it because of the models in the posters man facepalming and also continued to say every girl feels this way, that's why you always see the men standing outside of vs and not inside with their gf wife. Can anyone give me their opinion on this or what I should do or am I just thinking too much of this or just what? I could be wrong but I'm pretty sure many of the guys stand outside of vs because they're embarrassed, not interested in going in lol. I don't know any women who tell their partners they're not allowed in. I think she is extremely insecure. This is not normal behavior. Every girl does not feel this way and she's being very controlling. I've probably been in VS more than my wife B, CI buy 90% of her clothes and that's the underwear. She likes. This includes when we were dating. I seriously think I only keep this app to appreciate how amazing my wife is and how that has translated down to our children. I fear for this world. Your mom, I mean GF needs to calm down. She is obviously insecure and asking for these things to reduce her own jealousy. I suppose she is within her rights to ask for it. But you are completely within your rights to politely refuse. I personally wouldn't tolerate that level of distrust from my partner. Even if it meant the end of the relationship. That's a lie because I see bunch of guys in Victoria's Secret, she's very very insecure. This is batshit nuts. Honestly I'd break it off. You can't fix this kind of insecurity without a genuine desire on her. Part and probably a fair amount of therapy. Find someone who doesn't have massive insecurity and jealousy issues. Alright so coming from personal experience here. I'm a 21F who was exactly like her. Now I'm still working on changing but for the first two years of my relationship it was so bad that I would only put animated shows on. Animated kids movies at 18 to 19 because I didn't even want a commercial to come on with an attractive girl. I still have the boundary of no porn or strip clubs because they're reasonable for a lot of people. Anyways after so long of being really controlling he started pushing away from me and his words eventually sank in. So I had to work really hard on myself and my own insecurities. My insecurities personally are based off of a physically, emotionally abusive relationship I was in with a crackhead who broke my bones for two years and my current boyfriend cheated on me when we were 16. 
Also my brother raped me when I was 15. That shit really fks you up. Makes you feel worthless. It was my choice to get back together with him and was holding on to our past as kids. So I needed to let that go first of all. After a lot of research as I couldn't afford therapy I figured out that I felt the need for control. And basically hated myself so anyone was prettier in my mind. If this relationship is gonna work she's gonna have to swallow her pride and admit she has an issue. Behaviors like this are deep-seated and she's gonna have to really try to change. You aren't going to be able to live your life with your head down like a dog. Those words came directly from my boyfriend's mouth. That's the sentence that made me realize what a bitch I was for making him feel like a child who should worship me. I've been working at this for over a year and I still have a way to go so it's not easy or quick. I can't even read this whole thing. She has a lot to sort out. My sister is insecure like her and it is exhausting and infuriating. Tell her there's an Amish community down the road. She and Yolder Smith can take the horse carriage out for a spin. After the clothes are hand washed. The cows are milked. And the butter is churned. Otherwise 98% of American men look at some form of pornography. I agree with your girlfriend on strip clubs but what the fuck? You're 19 no longer a kid but an adult and sure porn is immoral but movies like Wolf of Wall Street. That's just straight up crazy monot this rate what it looks like is if you ever watch any movies or TV shows with sex scenes or kissing scenes you will have to skip them by going to the bathroom to avoid a conflict with your GF. How long does she think she can cover nudity for you? You're not a baby, mon. In fact she's acting just like my mom and this feels horrible. Make it clear to her that you're at the age where you can do this and it's fine. Just reading your post stressed me out so much. Can't imagine how you can deal with this. I took my BF into VS with me and he was painfully uncomfortable because I kept asking him what panties and bras would be okay. I didn't realize till afterwards that the older woman who worked there kept following us watching him. I think your girlfriend is definitely extreme. I understand no strip clubs. It makes sense. Porn is something everyone consumes at one point in their life. Sure it can be damaging in certain situations but generally people are not in love with porn stars. And for movies and TV shows I am just gonna not comment because I dk what that is. Consider talking to her or leaving the relationship because this is emotionally hard for someone to be controlled and monitored like a child. Also I do not tell my boyfriend he isn't allowed to do anything. Trust is a wonderful thing. Sounds like she's jealous, possessive, controlling and insecure. These are her problems, not yours. I was married to one of these people for 17 years. This is a problem that you can't fix. It ended in divorce. She sounds overly controlling and insecure. At the end of the day it's not your partner's job to force their personal boundaries onto you. What is their job is to communicate explicitly what their boundaries are and then establish whether or not that's realistic for you. I would have a conversation with her and be like, I completely understand where you're coming from and I respect it. I don't have an issue with seeing nudity in movies and television and that's something I'm not willing to compromise to the extent you're asking me to. It has gotten to the point where I feel you're disrespecting me. I have promised you that I would not watch porn or go to strip clubs and I have kept my word. A relationship is nothing without trust and I have done nothing for you to continuously question my loyalty at this point. If she's unwilling to compromise or show you the respect you deserve then I would consider re-evaluating the relationship at that point. This is not normal and she is being way too insecure. 
she might have had some trauma growing up or maybe parents instilled this onto her. You have two choices either stay knowing this will keep happening or do what you should which is talk to her about the problem and try to meet halfway. I personally think covering your eyes and going into VS is not okay at all. I personally would have ended the relationship. Good luck. Oh, those are big red flags and she is pretty insecure. I couldn't be in that relationship. Don't let her run your life bro. Put your foot down and explain to her that you'll watch whatever you goddamn want. And if she has a problem with it. She can kick rocks no kizzy crossmark build cap smile with horns. LMAO. My fiancé literally drags me into VS going, do you like these? How about this? And then we get dinner and go to a strip club after. We both love nudity. You got yourself a very insecure woman. ID leave over that TBH. Cause you're right. It's childish and it diminishes your self-pride. It'll get worse over time. It's a her problem. While having a no porn or strip club boundary is okay for someone to have. It only works if both of you are acceptable with that. If you're not, then you're just simply not compatible. Regardless of what the boundary is. This is how they work. You need to be with someone whose boundaries are similar enough to line up and work together. It will never work with opposing boundaries. So this being okay for you and for her is fine. Like it was at the start of your relationship. The rest is not fine. She has escalated this severely. Now you cannot watch a nudity scene in a show? Cannot see a model's public display poster? Children are allowed in VS and can see those posters. That is not your original agreement at all. So she's pushed you and pushed you until you've slowly become what she's wanted. That's manipulation. She will just keep on pushing you even more until you can't go to a restaurant store alone. There is a 50% chance every person you see will be female. You can't go out with your friends because you might discuss females. And don't you dare know any female friends. You can't work this job because your boss is a female. You can't go alone for a holiday at your parents' house. Because your female cousins will be there. Her insecurity has already escalated and is currently spiraling. And will continue to do so without some major therapy for her. Her reasoning is really off. She's afraid if you watch a show by yourself you'll touch yourself. So? Healthy masturbation should not be an issue. There are extremes that are not healthy. But that's not what this is about. Is she jealous of you receiving any physical attention? Even from yourself? Does she consider masturbation cheating? That is a thing. Is she afraid you'll escalate to cheating? There is something unhealthy going on here. And it's not good at all. And since you say it's only getting worse, it will just continue to do so until you have zero say, want, need that is your own. She is in need of some major outside help if she is jealous of a character being portrayed by an actor. Or if she's not, at 20, mentally, emotionally mature enough to handle these scenes to the point where she's reverting to childish ways, covering eyes like a 10-year-old. Or if she's going to automatically assume this is leading to or is you cheating. I've been with my hubs for almost 20 years now. How do I handle nudity on the TV? Well the other night, the scene kept going back and forth to a woman whose breasts were on display. Each time I pointed at them and said boobies. Because I am a reasonable and mature woman. Anyways. Seriously reconsider your relationship. You have an entire life ahead of you. Find someone that is compatible to you and brings you joy in all areas. Stay away from someone who makes you so uncomfortable. Manipulates you. Gets extremely mad for ridiculous reasons. And controls your every move and thought. The fact that you've fallen in love and it's difficult to move on. 
was the entire plan all along. That is exactly how relationship manipulation works. Someone gets so caught up and doesn't even realize what's happening until it's too late. P.S. ISS called. The pile of red flags that is your GF can clearly be seen from there. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.